previously on The Walking Dead. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Pipo's awake. Solamente está confundido. Mama! Oh my god! Oh my god! Put your hands up and close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh! Shit! Kate! Javi, don't! Hey, what do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? I'm sorry, Clem. What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. being out so close to dark. It's harder to see them coming. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little, in front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it and that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day for food and water and gas for the stove. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. <sighs> I know. It's just hard to get used to, that's all. We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. There it is! Let's take it and go. empty. Why would we get that lucky? I mean, it's not like we needed it or anything. Easy, Kate. Maybe there's something else we can use in there. Yeah, okay, maybe. But we came out here for that tank. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. Okay. I wanted to kill it. I really did, but I 
didn't know him. That was one of Cape's friends. True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. That's not Drew anymore. I know, it, it still looks like him, but... The kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this... thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people, if they're just the dead... <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were gonna die. I thought... Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. When it was on you? Oh my god. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. <sighs> Can we go back now? I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back. But it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there. For an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. What makes you think it's going to be better anywhere else? Everything and everyone outside this door is dead. Exactly. How long until one of those things gets in? We stay, somebody's going to get hurt, or worse. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cabe. We're safe inside the house. A and I bet we can find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We're tired of being afraid. Every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now. While we still can. But what about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. We have to look out for ourselves now, Gabe. I wish things were different. But our safety's more important. But we're safe here. No. We're not. I'm sorry, Gabe, but Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe, honey. What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? Uncle Javi? I'll tell you when you're older, okay? Just tell me. I can handle it. I don't think so. We can't lie to him, Javi. He needs to know. Your friend, Drew, from down the street? He... He didn't make it. He... He turned into one of them. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started, okay? What are we gonna tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Just tell him we love him. All of us. And nothing's gonna change that. Not ever. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really.
Dad? Javi! Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. Never really thought it happened. Not after all this time. I... I thought you were dead, man. I, I thought you'd been dead for, for a long time. No such luck. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. She's coming inside! But she hasn't been checked. This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No, I didn't say that. Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. It's how we keep it safe for everyone. Fine. Let's just get this over with. Javi. Make my job easy, would you? Listen to your friend. <sighs> Whatever you say. Let's go. the car without you in it I didn't know what to think the engine up and died I came here looking for help and this happened I've been so worried about Kate I told them she needed a doctor they promised me someone would look into it please tell me they found her they definitely didn't look for her because she was still in the car but that's crazy I told them she was dying and clearly it wasn't a priority. Well, at least those assholes realized she needed a hospital once they saw her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond, their new frontier. Oh my god. Oh, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. So he's my brother. So what? We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. Nobody's implying anything, Javi. Speak for yourself. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. David was gone. I had to step up, make sure the family would be okay. It's not like I could just walk away from her, from any of them. No, of course not. Family drama aside, Hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it. I hate to admit it, but there's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen, it's 
possible. Clementine, you were part of the New Frontier. Did you know David? I knew him. If I'm being honest, he's not a good guy. Is that right? If you told me he was the one behind Prescott, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm the first to admit my brother can be kind of a hard ass, but he's not that bad. People change. What happened at the gates? The fact that he's your brother? That doesn't change anything. I'm gonna find the man who killed Francine. These people better not get in my way. I'm gonna be asking questions about what went down at Prescott. And I won't stop until I get answers. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say, for now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already, Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. Thought I taught you better than that. That in order, David? Fucking with me already, huh? Some things never change. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip. Just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll put in a good word for you, okay? See if we can't hurry the process along a bit. Thanks. with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. No problem. You won't have to worry about them. Didn't sound that way. They just need time to get used to things. I hope you're right. Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. I don't know what Gabe's been telling you. You saying he's a liar? He's been through a lot. Sometimes he blurs reality and fiction. I doubt he'd blur his sister's death. He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? Mariana saw things that other people didn't. She, uh... She told me she wanted to write down her memories to keep them alive after she was gone. Sounds like her. Always was a dreamer. How... How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She went quickly, David. 
without pain. Gabe said it was people, not walkers. People with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Bastards knocked me out and threw me in their truck. I got away near this town, Prescott. The same assholes attacked us there. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. Fuck that. They'll have to drag me out, feet first. Cut that shit out. Well, that'll be exactly what happens. I run security here. But it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava. This is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. Well, baseball's long gone. Just regular old survivor brother now. <laughs> From what I hear, there's nothing regular about you. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. Did you even try? How can you even ask that? I don't know, David. You seem like a pretty capable guy. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of him, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for Kate. Is that right? This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat, turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> get off me! Hey, up, huh? You know me. I'm always okay. It's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. Gross. I'm pretty sure you have to say that. Doesn't make it not true. Ah! 
What, you okay? Oh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the duck. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. Let's just get you better, Kate. The facilities here... I don't care about facilities. We did fine without them before. You didn't have a ruptured spleen before. These people nearly killed me, Javi. David's people. Have you forgotten, Mari? Of course not. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. It's going to get bad if we stay. I don't know, Kate. We were on our last legs. Javi. Whatever problems this place has, it's worse out there. For you, maybe. Whatever. Just please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. She was rambling a bit. Yeah, I think she's delirious. Well, she seems cogent now. But it's nothing to be alarmed about. Pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. Well, that miracle worker's named Eleanor. She tried to tell you people that Kate needed help. Instead of listening to her, you threw her in quarantine. She's here? We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. The rest of those guys can contribute. If that's what it takes to get free. They're all pretty handy in a fight. That's why they're all under guard. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> no complaints here. I get that you guys have a way of doing things. Thank you. We have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach. 
over my magnificent black forest gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi, take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden or a baked delicacy by yours truly? Everything looks so good, I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us, and Dr. Lingard, make all the decisions here, so, yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. People telling me what to do usually rubs me the wrong way. Most feel that way when they first arrive. Usually they learn we have their best interests at heart. And those that don't? We ask them to leave. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. You're gonna regret that when you're older. You know, for job interviews and stuff. Ugh, smartass. <laughs> Laugh all you like. Someone takes our mark. They're committed. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask, but I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. Funny you should say that. Some of your people, they keep me awake. In fact, some of them give me nightmares. My people? I'm sorry, Javi, I don't quite follow. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. Did you steal gas from us? I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. He shot Rufus. In the back. You did what? We found the body near the wreck of Rufus's truck. You cold cocked me with your pistol. I woke up in a truck with cable ties on my wrists. That don't make it right. Rufus was bringing you here. We wasn't gonna hurt you. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to killers. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, 
We need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They used tear gas. There was nothing left of Prescott when they were done. Badger did that. Not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you... You're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. This is ridiculous. You have to do something. I... I can't right now. But maybe I can down the road. Just stay alive. Okay? What the fuck? We didn't do anything. I might do something here in a minute. David packed this. He did. They said... Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! Stop! You're gonna get us killed! Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. We trusted you. What the hell, man? Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could've just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Okay. There's Richmond. That helps. But we can't go back there. Knowing where it is lets us know where we are. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. And if this is us here, then I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. And to find north... We need to find the North Star. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. Deal with it.
Take it. Please. Take it. Call it an apology. That man back there in the tunnel, that wasn't me. Take the gun. Conrad, don't let the past get in the way of common sense. Give him the gun, Javi. I can find something along the way. Always have. I don't like it. Let the man decide. The gun is yours, Conrad. I can handle myself. Nobody fires a single shot unless you are deep fucking fried. You hear me? We don't want to attract whatever the hell's out there. I gotta tell you, man, I thought you and Kate were, you know, I wouldn't have guessed she was married to not you. I ain't judging, mind you, I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't my business, I know, but what have we got to lose out here? Honestly, I'm sorry. I just don't know you that well. All right. I understand. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. If they're one and the same or otherwise. You know what I mean? <laughs> just when you think you got everything figured out. No, if it wasn't messy, it wouldn't be important, right? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Just saying, man. Three things that never hide forever. The sun... The moon and the truth. Eleanor and I, we were... something at some point. But nothing now. I respect her wishes. I really do. I just wish my heart respected mine. Jesus got his eye on something. What you got for us, man? Listen. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. We better scoot. Walkers. Get ready. They're near. Look alive, people. I got him. Come on, man, move your ass. You want a piece of this? Careful with this. Where even now? I 
This is a bad idea. We're following David's map right into a herd. For all we know, he's trying to get rid of us. Come on, Clem. He's my brother. You can't trust him, Javi. I learned that the hard way. I never wanted to need people again, but I had nowhere else to go. The New Frontier gave me this and made me one of them. They promised they'd help him. That turned out to be a lie. Clem. Dr. Lingard, what's the matter with you? I'm... I'm fine. Clem, please don't. The vancomycin, that's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. I told you, it could save someone's life if used right. It's too valuable to throw away. You don't know that for sure. Sadly, I do. It's my curse. Your curse? Knowing when someone's gonna die. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I... I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. Clem, put the drugs back before anyone finds out you took them. You know what they do to thieves here. There's still time. I have to try. What the hell was that? Come on, AJ, stop. You need to hold still. Here we go. <laughs> AJ, shh. What the hell is this? I told her it was a bad idea. You fucking high again? Pull yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. How could you be so stupid? So selfish? But did you think I would just give up on him? AJ is everything to me, David. I'd do anything to keep him alive. Except there's nothing left to do. That waste? That'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough! We should have left him out in the woods a week ago! But look! It's helping! It doesn't work that way, Clem. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. 
I wish I could tell you it would save him, but that's the reality. I'm sorry. I thought there was a chance. At least he's not suffering. You think that's worth the cost? We opened our arms to you, made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. You broke our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. There's no place for you in the New Frontier. You've made that pretty damn obvious. I made the right call. One you refused to make. Well, I'm making one now. Get your shit and get out. Maybe we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Come on, AJ. We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. Can't take him with you. That ship has sailed. You're cruel. You don't even want to take care of him. Clem, he's in no condition to travel. Let him go, Clem. He'll only drag you down out there. No! You monsters! What about this? What was it all for? Don't forget, I'm one of you. Not anymore. Let her say goodbye. We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Say what you need to say, then you go. Sorry, AJ. I wish I could do more for you. Come on, Clem. AJ would be the one. Finally. The one what? The one who didn't die. I can't believe David would be so... heartless. My little goofball. I survived. He didn't. That's... that's just the way it goes sometimes. This is what David circled on the map. Our smelly friends are back. Many of them push against this, it might give. Gotta find a way in. Here they come. I can... Uh, fuck! I can raise it a little, but... I don't know, something's wrong with it. Jammed or some shit. Maybe we can force it open. We're gonna have to. Well, there's a car. With no wheels. Shit! God damn it!
any higher. Everyone get in! Close. You can say that again. Hey, I'm here! David! Don't you dare let that fucking baby killer in! <gasps> Don't make me do this! Clem. Don't do it, Javi! Open up! He'll die. He deserves worse. Come on, hurry up! <laughs> Should have trusted my gut about you. We need to barricade the door. <gasps> Did you let him turn? Clementine, no! Don't do Shut this! Shut the fuck up, Javi! We didn't have to worry about that. What the hell does that mean? He lived, Clem. He lived. But how? He was dying. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. It was... a miracle. You're lying. I wouldn't believe him either. What you believe doesn't change the fact. AJ is alive. Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's in Richmond? Dr. Lingard took care of the boy. He'll know how to find him. Then I'm going back. None of us are going anywhere until the walker's clear. What's your plan, David? We used to store a vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. Wait. This is a send-off? You're, you're just seeing me on my merry way. You think I want this? Well, you're not doing much to stop it. I don't see another way. <laughs> Shit! Board it up. <laughs> we need something to buffer. Something heavy. There! Help me! Way to have. 
half second. Where'd you find this? Over there. Show me. What the hell is all this? These could come in handy. Don't want to just take them, but... I might be going crazy, but... I think these came from Prescott. That's Phantom Punch. I don't understand how all this got here. Like you don't know. Hey, none of this stuff was here before. I don't have a damn thing to do with it. We've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts, for emergencies. Come on, David, don't play dumb. What are you suggesting? That I was part of looting Prescott? You must have known something. You think I condoned this? This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns I heard got raided a while back. There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. Look how many there are already. Goddamn herds nearly on us. Hurry the fuck up. You hurry up. Wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't gone all trigger happy on David's family. Take cover. Fuck him. I'd do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? You only just realizing that now? I told you. Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. That shit is the new gold. Shame you can't take it with you. David? I thought better of you, Max. I really did. David, come on, man. We're a unit. There's no need for... Stop him! He's getting away! Go! Get Badger! Shove that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. But this'll do. Took my goddamn guts out. Um, um, fuck. Oh, you must be up good. You're the worst kind of filth, Badger. This is how it had to end. Oh. <coughs> Bring it then. See if I see if I give a shit. Easy, Conrad. He's already down. Remember my woman? Francine? You! You 
snuffed her out like she was nothing. <coughs> she was nothing. He's finished. Get it over with. Come on. What are you waiting for? We've got to move. No point drawing it out. Conrad? What? Ain't got the guts to kill another man. No. You're not a man. You're nothing. You betrayed who we are. You betrayed Richmond. Come on, David. This is Richmond. What's that supposed to mean? What's that supposed to mean? I ain't got nothing to say. Start talking, or I promise you, you're gonna scream. Okay, okay, take it easy. I'm waiting. Come on, man. It wasn't like we were doing this by ourselves. Joan was in on it. We did it on her orders. She... She said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm... I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. Please, don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. I'll help you get back inside. Expose her to the others. We don't need you for that. Where's Lonnie? He gave us the slip. Hightailed it back towards Richmond. Son of a bitch. If he warns Joan... What about the other two? Won't be hurting anyone else. My people need to know about what we found here. What about your missing friends? I'm not holding out much hope. Don't have time to keep looking. They'd want me to get home and warn them. So that's what I'm gonna do. Sooner the better. You're a good guy, Jesus. That's rare. I could say the same about you. I won't forget about you. You have my word. It's a shitstorm out there, man. I don't see how you're gonna make it. One step at a time. We need to get back to Richmond fast. I have loved ones in there. We both do. We all do. I gotta break Eleanor out of there. Once she's safe, I... I'm gonna tell her how I feel. You said it yourself. If it ain't messy, it wouldn't be important, right? We're gonna need allies in Richmond. Lingard and Clint, they're our best bet. If I can get to them before Joan does, maybe we have a chance. I know I was ready to say goodbye before, but I can't do this without you. Can I count on you? I won't be able to pull this off myself. Fine. But I expect first-class treatment when we're done. No more quarantine for me or my friends. Just the red fucking carpet. Of course. Whatever you need. Let's just get this done. If Lonnie raises the alarm, they'll be waiting for us at the gates. There's a way in round back that'll get us around any sentries. We can take Badger's truck. I doubt he'll mind. Come on. We gotta get on the move. Herd's closing in.
thinking this will go a lot better if we split up. A group this big can't exactly sneak around, particularly if they're expecting us. Eleanor's in there somewhere. I'm going after her. Then I'm coming with you. Lingard brought her to the clinic. That's your best bet. Javi, that's where you'll go to get Kate and Gabe. Then bring them to my house. It's the one with the raven on the hitching post. We'll all meet up there. After I pay a little visit to Joan. Stay out of sight. They'll be keeping an eye out for us. Just don't wait up for me, okay? Javi? I'm gonna do whatever I have to to keep Kate and Gabe safe. After that, I'm not promising anything. Javi, just follow the plan. I'm counting on you to hold up your end. I'll scout ahead. What about you, Clem? I'm pretty sure I've still got some friends in the New Frontier. If they know where AJ's being held, they'll tell me. As soon as I find him, I'm taking that truck and getting the hell out of here. Well, you are owed a vehicle. Keep an eye on David. He may be playing nice, but I'd still watch your back. Give me a little credit, Clem. I can handle David. I really hope you're right. The only thing that matters is staying alive. See you when I see you. David said to hang a ride up at that corner. Seems clear so far. Let's move. You know Javi Garcia? He used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? That's who we're looking for? Yeah, that Javier Garcia. Anyway, sounds like some paranoid horse shit. Guy's a fucking ball player. There's the medical center. Gonna go ninja's way back in here and stir up trouble. We go yeah, in, we get L, we get Kate and Gabe, man. we get out. Right. Not that easy, man. We've seen them make haze before, and they ain't afraid to use them. All right, let's hang out here for a while. Smoke break. Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? What the hell was that? Let's check it out. You go first. Still got it. You guys find out. Tell her we're moving Kate. Sounds good. We'll meet you here. Javi! We thought you were... I was... super worried. Like, a lot. We have to leave, Gabe. Now. Oh. Okay. I'm sorry. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? Your dad's taking care of a few loose ends. And right now, he needs me to take care of you. Oh, okay. David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay there. Then let's go. Wait, Javi? While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. I felt like she was sizing me up. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble, like he was no longer in charge. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but 
It only made me worry more. I got a bad feeling from her. She's a scary lady. But don't worry. David's gonna handle her. He knows what to do. Scary how? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. We found all this stuff from Prescott. She was behind Prescott? David's rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you think it's worse on the road, but you have to see reason. This isn't our fight. We already lost Mari because of these people. Now, the whole place is about to become a war zone. I hear you, Kate, but we can't just let her get away with it. You're not hearing me. This is not our problem. What's going on? Tripp said we had to move to David's house. We're not doing that. We're getting the fuck out of Richmond before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? What about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe, we don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But he won't know where we are. Again! I can't go back to how things were before. I'm sorry. I just can't. I'm sorry, Gabe, but we have to get out of here. If we're leaving, I've got to get some things for the road. All my stuff is stashed in the room they gave me. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds good. <laughs> Gabe, come help. I got it. Come on, buddy. I'm not going, Javi. What? I'm gonna find my dad. I have to. I'm sorry. Gabe, no. You can't do that. You're making a mistake. But it's mine to make. Gabe, no. Kate. No. Please, Gabe. Please. I never thought I could be a mom. I never thought I wanted to be a mom. Until I met you and your sister. I'm begging you. Don't do this. It's my dad, Kate. I can't lose him again. And I can't lose you. Kate, we need to go. Now. Look at me, Gabe. Please. It's his father, Kate. It's what he wants. And this is what you want. What we want. We got so close in the last few years. I... I thought Gabe would want to stay with us. I really saw him as my kid. I guess he didn't feel the same way. He's growing up fast, Kate. We have to trust him to do what's right. I know. It's just hard to say goodbye. I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. I'd talk fast. Fast and clear. Easy now. No need for violence. That's him, right? The brother? Thought so. Bring him in. Run!
I don't like your tone, David. If this is about your brother... Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. You've got a lot to answer for. Me? You must be joking. What's this? They were trying to leave. Him and his lady friend. Leave? I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe, not tuck your tail and run. Were you really gonna desert me when I needed you most? It was a matter of self-preservation. You're gonna get us all killed. Great. Good to know your faith is strong. Where are they now? Girl got away. No sign of the kid. We'll deal with this later. And despite what we all agreed, you smuggled your brother back into Richmond. What happened to you, David? It hurts me to see you betray your own people. You've got some damn nerve. We used to be so close. Now I hardly know who you are. You can talk. If anyone betrayed Richmond, it's you. What are you people talking about? So this is your play? First you accuse Badger, then you come after me. Would someone please explain what's going on? I can. Lonnie? Go ahead, Lonnie. Tell us. They attacked us. Murdered Max and Badger. You son of a bitch. They would have got me too. But I was lucky. They would have killed us if they'd had the chance. You admit murdering our people. Those assholes were raiding other settlements. Killing and looting on Joan's orders. Is that true, Joan? <laughs> it's nothing but a smoke screen. A pretty damn transparent one, if you ask me. Lonnie, please tell me this isn't true. We did that. Raided those communities. Hurt those people. Because David told us to. Not Joan. I'm sorry, David. I can't do this anymore. I can't hurt anyone else. This is wrong. I am asking you, please, tell them the truth. This is bullshit. He's covering for Joan. David, just stop. We knew this couldn't last forever. We confronted him. Me, Badger, and Max. We were done. We let him know. He said he didn't need us anymore. Not with his brother here now. That's when he... That's when Badger and Mac... That's enough! David, stop! Paul, you have to stop her. Or the blood from those raids, it's on your hands. Don't let Joan get away with this. Paul! She's working you like a puppet, man. Can't you see that? Don't let yourself get played into doing something you regret. Maybe we should sleep on this. Give everyone some time to cool down. No. Don't try and drag him into your mess. The things you've done, they're an assault on what we built here. You and your brother, you're going to have to answer for them. I still have friends here. Allies. This won't stand. You brought this on yourself, David. I'm sorry to say it, but you're done here. They were our family, David. How could you? I'll give you family! <laughs> 